Yes, even the infernal manacles of YouTube could not hold me bound forever. <laughs> Um, yeah, so you may or may not have noticed that it's been pretty quiet around here lately. That's because YouTube have helpfully locked me out of my account because I've been naughty boy too many times. And if it happens again, they might delete my account altogether. So I thought I'd better take advantage of this brief lull in my persecution to warn you that at any moment, my Phantom Reviewer account and all its videos could be wiped off the face of the internet. If that happens, I don't want you to feel all lost. So I've set up a precautionary measure of setting up a site mirror. So please subscribe to the Phantom reviewer on YouTube as well. At the moment there's nothing really on there so this does still remain my main channel but just in case I'm locked out of my account or in the worst case it all gets deleted I'll be re-uploading my videos there and posting my new season 3 on there as well. Also stuff that gets removed due to copyright claims will also end up on Vimeo so do a search for Phantom Reviews on Vimeo to find any other missing videos. I'm getting really annoyed with YouTube at the moment. It all started a few months ago when they deleted part 2 of my Phantom of the Paradise review because of a copyright claim by Fox. Why they didn't claim part 1 as well is beyond me. That makes no sense! What irritates me about all this is that lots of people told me that they'd never even heard of Phantom of the Paradise before my review, and seeing it encouraged them to go out and buy the DVD. So if anything, I'm giving Fox free advertising. I really hate the way YouTube has gone lately. Stripping music off great videos and spoiling them. It's just not cool to go around disfiguring people's creative works. How would you feel if you painted a masterpiece that you spent a long time on, and then some git comes along with a knife and slashes a big section out of it because, oh, you drew the Paris Opera House in the background, you don't have permission from Charles Garnier to use it. You'd be angry, wouldn't you? Uh, anyway, you may have noticed also that some of my Dario Argento reviews have been taken down, but they'll be back soon, I promise. I'm re-editing them so that there isn't a trace of Asia Argento or Carlotta's boobage to be seen since I'm pretty sure that's what YouTube are objecting to. Although I'm having to guess that because YouTube never actually bothered to tell you why something's took down, they just do it. <sighs> anyway, on to happier news. I recently recorded a 40 minute interview for an upcoming radio show on all things Phantom at blogtalkradio.com. The show will be airing on Saturday the 12th of September and I'll be talking about the history of Phantom reviews and some of my favourite Phantom movies and of course my least favourite Phantoms and you'll also hear a little bit about the upcoming reviews. If you can make it, I'd love some of you guys to phone in and talk about your favourite Phantom movies. So that's blogtalkradio.com. Do a search for all things Phantom. And if you miss it, if you're not around on Saturday, you can download it after. I'm also hoping I'll be able to launch Season 3 of Phantom Reviews by Saturday the 12th. And from then on, there'll be a new episode every couple of weeks or so. That's assuming my upload privileges haven't been removed from me again by the angry YouTube censor in the sky. <sighs> So, do you want a sneaky preview of Season 3? Of course you do! <laughs> Salutations from the other side. <laughs> <laughs>